Hello students welcome to science class today you are going to recall the topic electricity and circuits we use electricity for many purposes to make our tasks easier for example we use electricity to operate pump that lift water from wells or from ground level to the rooftop tank what are other purposes for which you use electricity yes we use electricity for lighting electricity makes it possible to light our homes roads offices factories even after sunset this helps us to continue working at night the supply of electricity may fail or it may not be available at some places in such situations a torch is sometimes used for providing light a torch has a bulb that light up when it is switched on where does the torch get electricity from electricity to the bulb in a torch is provided by the electric cell students let us recall about electric cell electric cells are also used in many other devices like alarm clocks wrist watches cameras etc have you ever carefully looked at an electric cell you might have noticed that it has a small metal cap on one side and metal disc on the other side did you notice positive sign and negative sign marked on the electric cell the metal cap is the positive terminal of the electric cell the metal disc is the negative terminal all electric cells have two terminals a positive terminal and a negative terminal students an electric cell is a device which converts chemical energy into electrical energy students here you can observe the picture of inside view of dry cell compared to the voltaic cells the electrolyte in a dry cell is not liquid hence the name dry cell the electric cell is also called dry cell because some chemicals stored within the battery they react with each other through a chemical process when the chemicals in the electric cell are used up the electric cell stops producing electricity the electric cell then has to be replaced with the new one students the same concept is continued in the next video